hi guys you're welcome back to my youtube channel in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys how you can create a pool on whatsapp so guys it's very easy to create a pool on whatsapp i'm going to be showing you guys in a few seconds so guys if you want to know how to do it just make sure you follow me to the end of this video and also if you're new to our youtube channel don't forget to like subscribe and leave a comment as that will tremendously help grow our channel so guys without any further ado let's get started so guys now the first step you have to take now is to tap on your whatsapp to open it so let me tap on my whatsapp right away so guys once your whatsapp opens up what you have to do now is to tap on the chat that you want to create this pool so guys you can create a pool on a whatsapp group chat and also you can create a pool on a private chat so guys let me tap on a private chat right away so guys now you can see i've opened the private chat on whatsapp i'm on someone's dm so guys now the next step you have to take now in order to create a pool is to tap on the clip icon you can see down there you can see down there the arrow is pointing at it tap on the clip icon so guys let me tap on it right away so guys now the next step you have to take now is to tap on where you can see pool you can see the pool option there the arrow is pointing at it so let me tap on it so guys now you can see what is written here create pool so guys this is where you can actually create your pool on whatsapp so guys now you can see the question section where you can actually impute your question and also you can see the options section where you can actually put options people can actually choose from in making their pool so guys now for you to impute your question for you to ask your question what you have to do now is to tap on where it is written ask question so guys now when you tap on it then you type in your question so guys now let me type in my question um let me ask a question what question am i going to ask now um okay let me just ask this question have you created a pool on whatsapp before so let me type it in have you created a pool on whatsapp before so guys now you can see i've imputed my question have you created a pool on whatsapp before so the next step to take now is to impute the options so guys now you can see where it is written add option that's when you need to add your options so guys, let me tap on the first one let me add my first option let me just put yes so guys now you can see i've imputed yes as the first option so to add the second option you tap on where it is written add so let me add the second option now so let me impute no so guys in case you want to add a third option what you have to do now is to tap on where it is written add so let me tap again let me just add maybe so guys now you can see i've added three options yes no maybe so let me just add the first option let me just add most likely so guys now you can see the options i added now for this pool so people can actually vote people can vote yes people can vote no people can vote maybe or most likely so guys after you're done imputing your question and your options the next step you have to take now is to tap on the send icon you can see there on the right hand side so let me tap on it right away but guys before i tap on that i would like to show you guys something let me scroll downwards now so guys now you can see where it is written allow multiple answers you can see there the arrow is pointing at it guys we don't want people to actually choose more than one option when they are voting what they have to do is to toggle this off you can see that the allow multiple answers feature is toggled on so guys if you don't want multiple answers what you have to do is to toggle this off if you toggle this off people will be able to vote once people will be able to choose just one option but if you toggle it on people will be able to choose more than one option they can choose yes they can choose no they can choose maybe and most likely at the same time they can even choose the four options but if you toggle this off if you toggle this feature off they'll be able to choose just one option so guys that's what i needed to tell you guys so i'm going to be leaving that allow multiple answers option on so guys let me leave it on so guys what i have to do next night to tap on send so let me send it right away wow guys can i see you have successfully created a pool on whatsapp so guys can see it you can see how it looks you can see the question there have you created a pool on whatsapp before and you can see the options yes no maybe most likely so guys now people can actually vote from these options so guys let me tap on the first option which is yes so guys now you can see i've chosen yes so guys remember i chose allow multiple answers so i can decide now to choose no as well and also choose maybe as well and also choose most likely as well so guys now you can see i've been able now to choose all the options because i enabled allow multiple answers so guys now this is how you can actually create a pool on whatsapp so guys is that easy so guys on the process of voting in case you want to view the votes in case you want to see how the votes are going what you have to do is to tap on where it is written view votes so guys let me view it right away let me tap on it so guys now you can see the pool details right here you can see remember i chose yes you can see one vote for yes one vote for no one vote for maybe and one vote for most likely so guys now you can see i voted for all the options so if other persons votes you're going to see the vote count right here you're going to see all the details so if someone now chooses yes you're going to see that under the yes you're going to see two votes so guys now this is how it's done
So guys, there's something else I want to tell you. You can actually share a pool on WhatsApp. Let me say you created a pool on a WhatsApp group and you want to share it to another WhatsApp group. It's not going to be possible. So if you created a pool for a private chat or a WhatsApp group, you cannot be able to share it. Where the WhatsApp pool was created is where it's going to remain. So guys, now let me show you guys that. So let me highlight this now. So guys, now you can see at the top here, there is no share icon there. So you can't share it, but you can actually reply to this pool. So guys, let me reply to it right away. Let me just write, I love this. So guys, now you can see I've replied to it. So let me tap on send. So guys, now you can see this is how it works. So guys, I've come to the end of this video and I believe you got value from this. If you did, make sure you like, subscribe and leave a comment. And also, if you're new to our YouTube channel, don't forget to hit the bell notification. So that never release new videos like this, you're gonna get notified. See you on the next upload. Bye-bye. Peace.